So today we're gonna see if we can power these little Christmas lights just by using some regular potatoes. So what you're gonna need is some potatoes, LED lights, some wire strippers. I'm using 14 gauge wire, some galvanized nails. I have leg bolts, a multimeter just to see how many volts each potato produces, some sort of a knife, and then I just have regular 16 gauge wire so I can tie these two LEDs together. So for the first thing, what you're gonna to wanna to do is cut a strip off about eight, 10 inches. Strip it down to bare copper. Find something that's round, place it on there like so, and then wrap it around a few times. Next, let's take a regular potato. If you got a potato this size, Go ahead and cut it right in half and you can make two batteries, double the bolts. I don't have any galvanized nails so I gotta use leg bolt, leg screws. Let's take the leg screw. On the other side, you're gonna wanna get your copper in there. So just put a little slice in here. Take another wire, wrap it around the galvanized nail or leg bolt or whatever you got. Take your multimeter, set it to 20. Put the red positive in the copper wire and your negative or your common on the galvanized nail. So let's hook a couple more of these up in series and see what we can get for voltage. 1.88, doubled it. So now I hooked up 13 cells and we'll see what the voltage reads. It's about seven. So we'll see now if it's enough voltage to power a little LED light Christmas bulb. Very faint, but it does come on. So they do produce electricity, but is it really worth the trouble? I highly doubt it. And I wasted a lot of potatoes.